Hey, how's it going? I'm Nick Gaska, and welcome back to I Could Do That DIY for another custom repaint video. Today we're customizing a Christmas ornament for my Christmas tree. Don't worry, we'll be doing more doll repaints in the future. I just figured I'd record this because I was doing this anyway. Alright, let's get into it. Today we're customizing this poodle ornament I got on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description below. Here are my poodles. I think you're familiar with Josie, my black poodle. I already have a Christmas ornament for her. Here it is. But I don't have one for my other poodle, Georgie. She's a party poodle and those ornaments are kind of hard to find. So I thought I'd start with a white poodle and repaint it. This is really awesome because now I can customize her spots exactly how they are. Alright, let's get started. Let's start by taking off the scarf. Alright, cool. Next, let's just get rid of this. I'm going to try to untie it and then just cut it off. Now let's get to painting. We're going to paint her spots with black acrylic paint. Alright, let's just reference all those spots and get started. We're going to start by brushing some paint onto her face. And while I do that, I just have to say thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Liking and commenting on the video really helps the channel and helps the video get out to more people. Also, hit that notification bell to stay updated on all of our latest projects. Also, make sure to follow me on Instagram. My more doll-focused Instagram is at Kawaii Dollies. It has a lot of my old work. My other Instagram is at I Could Do That DIY. Make sure to follow both. Alright, back to painting. So I'm just painting the rest of the head and her ears. Now let's focus on her back spots. I love her spots on her back, it's so cute. A lot of people don't know that poodles can come spotted. They're called party poodles, which is short for particularly colored. That means that they have at least 50% white on their bodies with spots. The spots can be in all sorts of different colors. So I did the big spots and now I'm just flecking in some little spots. Now let's do some on her front boots. And her little toesies. Cool. Just a little bit more touch up on her face and around her neck. Alright, awesome, I think she's all painted. Eh, just a little bit more touch-ups on her back. Now I'm just going to set it aside to dry, and then it's time to accessorize her. I'm going to be making a pink bow out of a ribbon and thread. I'm going to start by folding the ribbon, and then tying the thread around the ribbon to cinch it. and then knotting it to finish it. After that, I'm going to cut the tails to length, and then burn the edges to finish it. I end up cutting them a little bit shorter off screen. Now I'm just going to glue it onto the ornament with some super glue. Alright, let's give this bow a little sparkle. I'm just going to add a Swarovski rhinestone just to the center. We're just going to add a little glue. And just plop it on. Cool. Ooh, sparkly. I stringed four pearls together off screen and then glued the ends. Now I'm just going to glue it to the back of the neck. I'm just applying a little bit of bead glue draping it around to the other side, and repeating. Now I think it needs one more pearl just so it looks like it wraps all the way around. And with that, the base of the ornament is complete. Here it is so far. Looking pretty good. So here's what the original ornament used to look like. I think we made a big difference. Now we're going to add back the ornament tie. I'm just going to tie it back on. Trim it a little bit. Add a little bit of super glue to finish it. 
and to be a little bit more extra, we're going to add a little plastic flower to the end. I'm just going to stick it on and then add some super glue. Trim it a little bit. Add a little bit more glue. To finish off the center of the flower, I'm going to glue in a gold sequin. Awesome, it looks great! Now the ornament is officially complete. Now we just need to take some Christmas tree glamour shots. Awesome, it looks great! I know it's not my usual type of repaint video, but I thought it'd be fun anyway, just to get you into the holiday spirit. I'll be having a Christmas themed doll video coming out soon, so keep an eye out! Thanks again for watching, and for the rest of the video, enjoy the cute ornament! Overall, I think she looks pretty much exactly like she does in real life. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below! Thanks again for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Happy Holidays! Bye!